I can have Denise McEntee personally refute the venomous and vicious deliberate falsehoods that you have published about me on these various bulletin boards, and I will never let either of you two vermin on this program again, point, period. And I'll tell you what's more, if this persists, and pers particularly if you cite her as the source for your malice and your poison, you are going to get the comeuppance of your vicious little rodent lives. All right, enough for that. Let me say hello to Glenn right here on the uh, car. Diminish the public health impact of these companies, diminish the public health responsibilities that these companies should share. The Andrea Pizer is in the post today castigating Boeing, but Andrea Pizer routinely writes of the evils of government regulation. She postures as a conservative as well. Now they're all running for cover, making believe that they were not spreading the pernicious doctrine that encouraged this kind of mindset in the likes of the board of directors of Boeing or whomever. Right, well, it's easy to try to shift the blame once something goes wrong. You right. Try to take all the focus away from yourself and, uh, you know, do whatever whatever's going to make the public happy. Yeah, well, I'll You'll talk... change to... your agenda right on the fly just to, you yeah. know, clear your own name. I'll tell you about tax cutting and defunding the public sector. The po Coast Guard is too broke to even look for the bodies. That's in the paper today. The Coast Guard is so underfunded because of all the stupid tax cutting... And it's not your taxes that I that I I want to be raised. It's the corporate taxes right. on profits that have been cut by by uh, thirty by uh, seventy five percent over the past twenty years. Again, I'm going to repeat the statistics from Citizens for Tax Justice and my buddy Bob McIntyre down in Washington D.C. The percentage of government revenues that came that were derived from taxes on corporate profits was twenty six percent back in 1998. Today, the percentage of government revenue that is derived from taxes on corporate profits is 8%. That's where all the tax cutting has gone, not to you, the individual citizen. To the right, extent... But, right. And then they're going to raise taxes on the individual and raise taxes right. on small businesses, you know, but then they don't want to do the same thing to the large corporations, which is where you they can get it. a large amount of revenue. All right, I must run. Okay. Thank, thank you very thank much. Appreciate okay. it, Glenn. This is Jay Diamond. Percy is in Brooklyn. Hello, Percy. Yeah, I'm smoking a cigarette right now, okay? Uh -huh. <laughs> Let me tell you something. No one is going to tell me in my apartment that I can't smoke. I don't care if you burn. Let me <laughs> tell you something. What is this guy saying that you, in apartment buildings you can't smoke? This is my house, just like anyone else's house. I don't smoke in a work. I don't smoke a, 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 in public place. Yeah, but if I'm living upstairs from you or downstairs or across the hall or adjacent to you, the smoke gets into my room. Nah, it doesn't get in your room. What are you talking about? I know it does. It doesn't. It just stays here. No, no, no. You can smell it stinks up the hallways and it gets in. If you the... open the door, I don't open the door. Now what am I supposed to do? Uh, live in my apartment and never leave? If I open the door, I mean, oh, I have me. to laugh at a guy like this. I got to laugh at a guy like this. He wants me to uh, become a troglodyte. <laughs> I'm not a cave dweller. I have to leave occasionally. I don't, I'm saying, I don't open the door when I smoke. Okay? All right, all right. Thank you, person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But what do you smoke? I smoke Marlboro Lights. I'll send you a couple of packs for Christmas. Really? A couple, of, couple of cases, yeah. You're a good guy, okay. I always like you. <laughs> I get them cheap through the internet. You get them. You get your cigarettes on the internet. No, I buy them in the. Uh... No, you're crazy. You get them half price on the computer. Really? No, no tax. Yeah. Well, there's too much tax anyway. All right. Talk to you. Yeah. All right. This is Jay Diamond on News Talk 1050 WEVD New York. Back with Mike Chaplin. Let's welcome St. Andrews, New York's newest and finest restaurant to open in many years. Located at 120 West 44th Street between 7th and 8th Avenues, convenient to all theaters. St. Andrews serves the freshest fish, not frozen, prime meats, lobsters, chicken, and all are prepared under the auspices of Martin and Mark Whelan with a background family of restaurateurs who know what their customers demand. St. Andrews delivers all your needs for a great day or evening of dining and imbibing, fabulous menu plus daily specials, a great bar with selections of over 50 single malt scotches and 101 choices of domestic and international beers, a superb selection of all wines, also, the desserts are the most delectable you've ever tasted. So call St. Andrew's Restaurant, 212-840-8413. That's 840-8413 for reservations. Seven days a week, lunch or dinner, you will not be disappointed. St. Andrew's Restaurant.
Do you need to learn the computer? Maybe you've been wanting to learn how to get the most out of your computer, but you just aren't sure how. Well, Video Professor, the number one computer software teacher in the world, will give you the opportunity to get on the Internet. Master Windows 95, Windows 98, Excel, Word, and many others absolutely free. Video Professor is making this incredible offer because we're confident that once you experience art, what you see is what you do learning method. You'll turn to us for all your computer learning needs. It really works. There's no gimmick. You pay only $4.95 for shipping and handling, and there's no obligation to buy anything else. Simply play your free CD or videotape and start learning. It's that easy. These lessons normally sell for $39.95, so this offer is free while supplies last. Call 1-800-216-8200 and choose computer lessons you want. Don't waste time or money on computer classes or frustrating manuals until you've tried Video Professor free. 1-800-216-8200. Master the software programs you've always wanted to learn right in your own home. What are you waiting for? It's free. 1-800-216-8200. When Vince and I heard about this special limited time offer, we decided, let's just shift that sofa six inches to the right and get started. Visit wingspanbank.com slash bonds, where new customers get up to $200 in savings bonds. Your reward for putting our bank in your debt. Get up to $200 in savings bonds. Only at wingspanbank.com slash B-O-N-D-S. Some restrictions apply. See site for details. Offer expires November 14th. Minimum balance is required. $100 for checking, $2,500 for CDs. First USA Bank, N.A., member FDIC. While searching the web, how do you single out the information you need when all you hear is noise? Northernlight.com. It's the only search engine that delivers the web, prioritized, categorized, and organized into little blue folders to help you cut through the clutter and find that otherwise elusive bit of information. Northernlight.com. Just what you've been searching for. Villa Barulia Restaurant, written up in Zagat's Guide as the Miracle on 34th Street, located at 107 East 34th Street between Park and Lexington Avenues. Villa Barulia has been serving great northern Italian food for 17 years. Johnny and Maria, your gracious hosts, run their restaurant as if it's their own home. Comfortable and relaxing dining with wonderful service. Villa Barulia is open Monday through Friday for lunch and dinner and Saturday for dinner only. Every day between 5 p.m. and 7 p.m., Villa Barulia serves complimentary hors d'oeuvres at their magnificent bar. And while dining, you can be assured that any dish will be the finest and freshest for your dining enjoyment. So call Villa Barulia at 212-689-1970. That's 212-689-1970 for reservations at a truly fine restaurant. Tell Johnny and Maria J. Diamond sent you, and if you need it, a private dining room is available as well. Hello, this is Bing Crosby. Wouldn't you want to become a part of California's moral emphasis program for traffic safety just by reminding your family and friends to obey traffic laws? The practice of courtesy and moral responsibility when we drive can and will save needless highway deaths and injuries. Be morally right. Drive safely and thank you. Thank you, Bing Crosby. All right, here I am with Mike Cachopoli back here on News Talk 1050 WEVD New York. Now look, I'm not going to stiff you like there's still time. Then there's plenty of time. I'm just going to take one call. Well, all right, let me quickly. I'll take two calls now, but very quickly. All right, uh, hello, Noah. Yes, I'm, I'm talking here amidst the stench of smoke, of cigarette smoke. I just wanted to call. I, uh, I didn't hear you earlier, but if you suggested that it should be illegal for people to smoke in apartment buildings,